Hello, Year 6. Uh, what I thought we'd do today is I'm going to see if I can share my screen with you and go through the Language Angels myself, rather than you going onto Language Angels' website. So here is the first page. I hope you can see that. And we are looking at Les Instruments. What you will need to do is say the word straight after me so that you know it. So don't just watch the video. Make sure you join in as well. So we are doing Les Instruments. Your go. And lay means le. Uh, the in plural. The first one we have is Je joue de la batterie. Je joue de la batterie. Next one. This one is Je joue de la flûte à bac. Je joue de la flûte à bec. Your go. And it means, je joue, I play, de la flûte à bec, the recorder. This one is, je joue de la guitare. Je joue de la guitare. Je joue de la clarinette. Yoga. Je joue de la clarinette. This one again is Je joue de la trompette. If you have a look at this one, I'm going to point to this word here. Can you see it says du? Now, normally, the piano is le piano, not la piano. When you get a le word, you just use du. You don't use du le piano. It is just du piano. Again, it should be le triangle. So it becomes, je joue du triangle. And again, if a look here, it should be le violon, but it's going to be, je joue du violon, not du le, just the word du violon. And we're back on la words now. So it is, je joue de la harpe. And this is the other one that's different. Because there's two symbols there, one, two, and it's a plural word with an S on, you would normally say les sandal for the symbols. So instead of les sandal, to say I place the symbols, it will be je joue des sandal. Have a go. And let's just finally have a look at the last ones. What's this one? Which one is this one? It is... Je joue du piano. Du piano. What's this one? The symbols. It's... Je joue des cymbales. Des cymbales. What's this one? The triangle. Je joue du triangle. It's this one, the guitar. Je joue de la guitare. Down here. Je joue de la trompette. Right at the top, the harp. Je joue de la harpe. De la harpe. And at the bottom, the violin, violin. Je joue du violon. That's right. Now, just before we go, I'm going to see if I can go back to the beginning, hopefully. Uh, I think it's this one. There we go. And we're just going to have a look at the spelling. So here, battery. It's la. The next one, flutabec. Don't forget, there's a little accent on the top of the a. And there's an upside down V on the U for flutabec. What's the difference between our guitar and theirs? 
they have an E on it, that's right. Now, clarinet. If you have the sound et, it is usually to E, double T, E. So with trumpet, it will be the same. Oh, there you go. Trumpet, E, double T, E. But it's not trumpet with an O. Oh, it's an ompet, trumpet. Piano is a lovely easy one because it's exactly the same as English. Triangle is the same as English as well, le triangle, but you just pronounce it differently. What's the different letter here? The way we say it is violin, they so say violon. The O-N says an on sound. Can you say that? On, violon. Now, in English, we would say harp. We wouldn't have the E like that. So they have a French word, has an, an E on, and they don't pronounce the H. They go ar, ar. The samba, C-Y-M-B-A-L-E-S. It's the same as English. You just put an S on for plural for this word. And there we are. Okay, so I hope that's given you a little bit of help. For those of you that haven't given your French in yet, um, please try and do it as soon as you can and send it in back on Dojo. Okay, I will see you later, Venice, year six.